स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ बी एस सी पार्ट वन एंड रेस्पेक्टेड लिसनर ए वेरी वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू टूडेज लेक्चर स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ बी एस सी पार्ट वन आई विल टीच यू टूडे वेरी वेरी स्पेशल टॉपिक सब्जेक्ट आई हैव मैंशन ऑन द ब्लैक बोर्ड टाइटल एज काइनेटिक्स फॉर जीरो ऑर्डर ऑफ लेक्शन विच इज सेलेक्टेड फ्रॉम बी एस सी पार्ट वन पेपर थ्री फिजिकल केमिस्ट्री चोजन फ्रॉम यूनिट फिफ्थ टाइटल्ड एज केमिकल काइनेटिक्स स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ बी एस सी पार्ट वन टूडेज लेक्चर टूडेज डिलीवर ऑफ द काइनेटिक्स ऑफ जीरो ऑर्डर ऑफ लेक्शन आर सिमिलर एज दैट ऑफ वी हैव डिलीवर्ड वी हैव डिफाइंड इन अवर यस्टर डेज लेक्चर फॉर काइनेटिक्स फॉर फर्स्ट ऑर्डर ऑफ रिएक्शन ऑन द बे ऑफ फिफ्थ पॉइंट वी हैव टू डेस्क्राइब टू डेज काइनेटिक्स ऑफ जीरो ऑर्डर ऑफ रिएक्शन मे हैव अटेंशन ऑफ ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ बी एस सी पार्ट वन ऑन अवर बैक फाइव पोस्टुलेट्स इन विच our topic of the kinetics of kinetics of bsc part 1 we were defining first one was mainly concern the derivation of rate equation or rate law which is further is calculated in the form of differential rate equation integral rate equation the differential rate equation for first order of reaction i have mentioned on the blackboard in equation number 2 and the integral rate equation we have derived in the form of equation number 8 k1 is equals to 2.303 divisible by t log a upon a minus x we have also plotted a is graphical representation between two important quantities y is equals to log a upon a minus x and x is equals to 2 when graphs are plotted between two important quantity y is equals to log a upon a minus x as an ordinate and x is equals to t as and that is of abscissa a straight line passing through the origin will be produced here we have also in next postulate calculate the value of half life period t half and next one postulate we have also calculated the value of willem equation and further more postulate we have also determined the value of dimension and unit for first order of reaction is k1 that constant for first order k1 is equals to timing inverse or is equals to that is of a timing is now further expressed in terms of second minute year hour and month then one can express the value of that constant for first order of reaction k1 second inverse minute inverse hour inverse year inverse etc etc on the way of hope, our previous five postulate now it is the turn to deliver today is the kinetics of that is of zero order of reaction let us try to solve let us try to deliver today that is of let us take today that is of first postulate derivation of rate law derivation of rate law for zero order of reaction the same we will derive by that is of two method first method differential rate equation method and second one method kinds that is of integral rate equation for this purpose we have to choose zero order of reaction in which one mole of reactant a by means of k0 to convert to produce as product here a student of bsc part 1 i have attention focus your concentration here how will you re represent the reaction is undergoing to show zero order of reaction suppose i eliminate here k0 the reaction show the presence of undergoing of first order of reaction but we have to prove it the reaction is undergoing by means of that is of zero order of reaction then in above by means of k0 substituting the zero order rate constant you have to prove 
it the direction is that is of zero order of reaction because zero molecularity doesn't exist in the field of chemical kinetics here once again to show the validity of the that is approval of zero order of reaction you have to write down that is of k0 in that is of upward equal or reversible sign here is i mentioned to present to show k0 here now next one the <coughs> that is of a two important timing here t is equals to zero we take initial a mole per liter of the concentration of the reactant a and next one that is of t is equals to t timing eight that is of we express the concentration a minus x where x in terms of degree of dissociation the product x is now formed here now next one by the definition of zero order of reaction is per rule per postulates of goodberg and wagge's law the law of mass action for zero order of reaction the rate is directly proportional to zeroth power of initial concentration which is present in terms of active mass zero that is of zeroth power here or minus d upon dt into a minus x is equals to in proportional we remove a constant when we remove proportional and the proportional is now removed by that is of a newly constant here that is of k0 here k0 a minus x0 where k0 is now at zero order that constant here now we apply by the multiplication of minus d a upon d t minus minus that is of plus d x upon d t is equals to anything raised to the power zero is equals to that is a unity is equals to k zero a minus x to the power zero to have to possess the unity value here and the differentiation of any constant quantity to give that is of a zero value 0 plus dx upon dt is equals to k0 first achievement regarding differential rate equation we have derived in the form of that is of here differential d, d r e d for differential r for rate and that is of e for that is of equation here so here that is of a differential rate equation say that is of equation number two equation number a now on solving and rearranging from equation number 2 let us start from equation number 2 here the dx is equals to k0 dt now on uh, now on applying the integral mathematical operation here integration dx is equals to integral k0 t k0 is a constant quantity we remove take out k0 is a constant now rest quantity of in, which is present in the form of integral integral dx is equals to to give the value of x is uh, here and integration that is of t to give the value of t plus that is of when we remove the uh, that is of integral so we require a newly constant here or such newly constant here is known as that is of integral constant here in our k0 is a zero order rate constant we are having here two types of the constant here first one k0 denotes here a zero order rate constant here and next one newly constant here we denote here that is of a integral constant in order to solve the value of integral constant now we apply the next condition mathematical condition here put down t is equal to zero and that is x is equal to zero in our previous equation number uh, four we have zero is equal to k zero into zero plus c there c is equal to zero here now put down the value of x is equal to zero the fundamental initial condition since t is equal to zero t is equal to zero x is equal to zero so we substitute the this we apply the mathematical condition in our fundamental that is of in our that is of previous in equation number four here the zero is equal to that is of k zero into c plus c then we uh, determine we calculate the value of integral cost at c is equal to zero say that is of in equation number five here now in next one equation now put down equation number five in that is of equation number four we have that is of here that is of x is equal to k zero t sixth b a newly achievement regarding the zeroth order of reaction in terms of 
that is the integral rate equation it is the fundamental rate equation uh, of four zero order of deduction while in the equation number eight show the fundamental integral rate equation for first order of deduction so you may compare for first order of reaction and that is of a zero order of reaction so on the way of hope, this one integral rate equation our first postulate is now completed here now it is the turn to deliver uh, to describe the graphical representation for zero order of reaction here so for the graphical representation for zero order of reaction now again pick from that is of integral form of uh, rate equation here let us start from that is of equation number six to be here now from equation of sex be here <laughs> x is equal to that you know here that is of x is equal to k0 t now it is k x is equal to k0 t it is the our fundamental rate equation for zero order of reaction now we compare it with that is a standard equation of a straight line that is equal to y is equal to mx plus c when we compare x is equal to k0 t y is equal to mx plus c when we compare as per relevant quantity in both the equations here so we conclude here y is equal to that is of x and m is equal to that is of k0 m denote here that is of slope and x is equal to the next quantity to give the value of that is of timing here the so first problem in various numerical problem in various competitive examination when question is set in which quantity for zero order of reaction the graphical representation will be taken into account and what will be the shape and size for zeroth order of reaction so on the behalf of our separation of this standard values these standard quantity so obviously you know here x is here that is of y is equal to that is of x and that is of x is equal to t y is equal to s graphical representation or graph will be pl plotted between y is equal to x as in that is the ordinate and that is of x is equal to t as in that is of uh, fcc here so you know here next one that is of we newly think that is of y is equal to mx plus c here newly that is types of the next con constant here two types of the c here first one that is of c denote here in equation number five integral constant here c denotes that is of integral constant here while in y is equals to mx plus c c denote here, here that is of it is not a integral constant here c denote here that is of intercept value the intercept value when we compare from equation number six b so obviously the value of intercept to percent as that is of zero here so students will be a part of one, one when a graph is plotted between y is equals to x as an ordinate and x is equals to t as on fcc a straight line passing through the origin will be that is of passing through the origin will be produced here so it is the shape and size of zeroth order of reaction here now the question also set for zeroth order of reaction in various competitive examination engineering and medical what is the value of a slope uh, for zeroth order of reaction uh, so obviously you know here that is of m is equal to the value of that is of k0 while in the case of first order the value of slope one can calculate in terms of remember let's go back our previous video for first order of reaction this is the value of slam m is equal to k1 upon 2.303 while in the case of zero order of reaction the value of slope one can calculate we state in the form of m is equal to k0 and in various examinations numerical also set here Okay, what is the value how will you calculate the value of uh, slope for zeroth order of reaction the value of integral uh, that is of that the value of uh, zero order of uh, constant k0 is given 1.28 per unit in such a position students have to write down the same value of slope m as the value in numerical given the value of that is of k0 here you will not overwrite you will not uh, extra work hard the directly while solving the numerical problem here once again the question numerical set in various examination in any examination the value is given for that is of k0 and students have to find out to ask what is the value of uh, uh, slope calculate the value of slope so in such a position the value of slope and uh, zeroth order of that constant k0 to give the equal value the same value here 
तो ऑब्वियसली आवर नेक्स्ट प्रॉब्लम इज सॉल्व हियर तो स्टूडेंट्स बी एस सी पार्ट वन ऑन द बिहाफ ऑफ आवर कैनेटिक्स बाई मीस ऑफ कैनेटिक्स वी हैव एक्सप्लेन टू डेज लेक्चर टू कैलकुलेट द वैल्यू ऑफ डेरिवेशन ऑफ रेट लो और रेट इक्वेशन बाय टू मीन्स इट्स फर्दर काइंड डिफरेंशियल रेट इक्वेशन इंटीग्रल रेट इक्वेशन एंड नेक्स्ट वन दैट इज योर ग्राफिकल रिप्रेजेंटेशन इन कमिंग टाइमिंग वी विल डिराइव वी विल सोल्व आवर थर्ड पॉस्टिट बेस्ड ऑन द कैलकुलेशन ऑफ हाफ लाइफ पीरियड एंड फर्दर मोर पॉस्टिट वी विल दैट इज डिलीवर एंड डिलाइव इन आवर क्लास रूम Uh, based on that is our uh, dimension unit and its determination a specific example now let me allow to me to join tomorrow till then thank you thank you very much